we are, we are in the business of trying to make the world better through solutions like uh, reduction of CO2 through the products that we uh, uh, produce. Not many people know that you know planes have got significantly lighter over the years and actually as a result, for example, less fuel is used and that's, that's beneficial. A lot of our products go into that or light weighting of cars, those kind of things. The business that we're in is one that is actually a, a significantly growing business. So the polyurethanes is literally in everything, you're sitting on it right now. So the foam in the seats, the soles on your shoes, the, the internal of your car, uh, the insulation that insulates your house. So from a, from a, a long-term perspective, it's a company that's going places and has been growing. Um, in terms of the opportunities within it, you know, the, the, the skill set that you can bring to the company is quite broad. So you can be anything from process engineering, you want to get into maintenance, you want to get into actual production or projects or safety. The, the opportunities are across the whole spectrum of um, uh, supply chain. Also, it's across the whole spectrum of opportunities that can exist in a company. At the same time, we're modernizing. So a lot of the uh, sort of what we call the 21st century industry 4.0 you know, a digitalization, working off pads, those kind of things is the direction in which the company is going. The first skill you want from anybody is, is ultimately somebody who's self-motivated, interested and excited to be in, in the chemical industry. And uh, uh, sometimes the chemical industry gets a bad rap, but actually if you look at the benefits that it brings, it's quite significant. So we want people who are energized to bring even more of those benefits to society. Um, at the same time, if I look at uh, uh, where we want to go, we're looking for skills like advanced analytics, people who are uh, skilled in taking us into the 21st century. Because if you look, you know, some of our plants have been around 20 years, 30 years. They all need to move into a, a new regime where we're able to digitalize. Uh, but this, we have everything from, as I say, process engineers, people who go into maintenance, uh, the safety engineers, and, and we're, we're fundamentally wanting all of those leadership skills. So we're looking for people who are uh, willing to be, uh, you know, to step up and, and, and take, take responsibility and accountability for the work that they do. general many of those are tend to be in the front line so with uh, training ships for people who are coming into the production environment and so on but for the right candidates we're always looking for opportunities to um, bring in trainee ships and what we call apprenticeships also so to train them up and then with a view um, after a certain period of time to on mutual of course agreement to bring them on board into the organization Very much that, again, as I say, on, on two fronts. One is whether there's an opportunity within the organization itself. But if we're, pro if we're approached by a very capable graduate and we see the potential talent in them, then we're also always willing to make room for bringing them on board and putting them in the right place to, to, to develop. What we call it, if you want to call it dating, you know, one of those exercises where we, we, we sort of sit in, in the canteen and we sort of rotate and we get an opportunity, uh, opportunity to effectively uh, uh, date for about 15-20 minutes uh, uh, new arrivals, we get to know them, they get to know us so it's, and that feeds a little bit into that whole family ethos where yeah, I, I'm, I like to think I'm a very approachable person but it's a lot easier if somebody's already had a chat with you and, and, and feels comfortable and knows you at a very personal level and, and those conversations are not only about work, yeah? They're also about um, who we are and our families and what interests us outside of the work environment. If you're somebody who's excited by the idea of being in the chemical industry, that's always going to be a prerequisite. But also to work for a company that is really focused on solutions for society's problems, then uh, yeah, we're the company for you.